My name is Taka Takata. I'm a regular employee and I'm almost 30. I also happen to be single. Oh, phew, this is damn good. The girl that's chugging this beer right next to me is Kairu Katsuki. She's also almost 30, a regular employee and single. You really drink and act like a middle-aged man still, huh? I don't want to be called that by someone who is an old man on the inside and outside like you. I'm just not scamming people by pretending to be something that I'm not. What is that supposed to mean? She looks to be a very pretty girl. That's why it's even more disappointing when you talk to her. She's always just walking around with her legs crossed and will get drunk and start getting crazy. <sighs> she should be a little bit more aware that she's talking to a man. Thanks to that personality though, she's also my best friend and has been for a while. Oh, hey. Shouldn't you button up your shirt a little bit more? What? It's so hot though. I don't care about it, but I know for a fact other people will see you will barely see a woman. You should care a little bit about how people see you. What do you mean barely? I'm 100% a woman. Stop! You're going to get arrested for false advertisement. I'm gonna kick your ass in a second. I want her to think a little bit more about what others would think when they hear this. Besides, I'm only like this around you. What did you say? Uh, nothing. If you didn't hear me, then that's the end of that. What are you talking about? If you got something you want to say, you should just say it. Man, it's been so long since we've been together, huh? The two of us. Yeah, I guess so. The first time I met her was when we were in high school. At the time, I just felt like she was just a girl that was easy to talk to. Before I knew it, we were both working and still went out to grab drinks from time to time. Thinking back now, we go out almost every Friday to talk about stuff that doesn't matter at all. It's actually just a regular routine for us now. We don't even need to invite each other. Besides, everyone else has already gotten married or are dating seriously. We can't just go out for drinks like we used to. I guess we're the only ones that are left behind, huh? Yeah, I guess we are. Around this age, all of my friends start having families. That meant we couldn't just go out and have fun and go for drinks. I mean, you're pretty good looking. I think you could probably find someone to date if you actually give it a try. N no, I'm fine. I don't want to deal with that kind of thing, you know? Mm-hmm. It's the same with you. You've never tried to find a girlfriend for the longest time now. Yeah, I guess so. I don't really feel the need to make a girlfriend, you know? As long as you were around, I didn't have to worry about who to go out with or anything like that, too. <laughs> what is that face? N nothing it's, it's nothing. I don't think it was the kind of face you can just shrug off as nothing, but... You really are unfair, you know. You say that kind of thing from time to time, like it means nothing, and I just keep falling for you. Haru, your glass is empty. You want something? Eh? Uh, oh, yeah, uh, th then I guess I'll have a beer. You've just been drinking beers this whole time. Two beers, please. You're also just drinking beers, too. You know, when you say beer, I just kind of get sucked into also ordering a beer. I get that. Alright, we're gonna drink till tomorrow morning now. I don't even have any plans tomorrow anyway. Oh, sorry. I've got plans tomorrow, so I'd appreciate if we leave in time for the last train. Huh? What do you mean, huh? I've got plans. Is that a problem? But, 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 but it's just so rare of you to actually have plans on a weekend. Well, I figured I'd try going to one of these things. Huh? Wait, is this? This is a speed dating party! And for people who want to get married! Yeah? No, not yeah! 
I mean, technically, not really. I'm going to the casual matchmaking side of it. Huh? Wait, y you want to get married? I mean, I told you a second ago too, but everyone seems to be getting married now, you know? But I figured that it's time for me to start thinking about things. I think it's okay for me to try going to one of these. Uh, right, uh-huh. Just relax, though. I'm not like the other guys. Even if I get married, I'm not planning on just abandoning you. We're best friends, after all. B best friends, right? Best friends! <laughs> what is it? N nothing. So, yeah. I'm going to be leaving in about an hour or so. Excuse me. Another beer, please? Hmm. Walk-ins accepted. Location is in Shibuya. Okay. The next day. Hmm. This is too lame. It had been 30 minutes since I came to the casual matchmaking area. I've tried talking to a few of the women that are here, but I just can't hit it off with them at all. Maybe I'm just not getting lucky with them, or I'm just not good at getting someone to talk a lot. I can't seem to keep the conversation going. If it was Karu, I probably would be able to keep talking even if I had a particular subject. Whatever. There's no point in complaining about that now. I'll try a little bit more then. I paid money to come here, so it's kind of a waste to just stand around all alone. Uh... Hey, miss! Would you like to talk to me for a little bit? <sighs> you know, after seeing you, I can feel something inside, you know? You look so amazing. Are you some kind of model or something? <sighs> uh, um... Huh? What? N never mind. Nothing. Taka. He just goes around and talks to all kinds of women. Pretty much anyone in his sight, he just talks to them. Was he really just that thirsty? He talks to a party animal looking girl and an older, calmer looking woman. He talks to skinny and slender type women and then talks to a short, cutesy woman. He really doesn't care who he talks to at all. You little piece of crap. The only reason that I've been single for so long is because you've been given a vibe that you're not interested in marriage or dating. I've just tried to stay content with being your best friend, but I'm almost 30 now and you're gonna go looking? I, I can't forgive you for that. Here, this is my contact information. Thank you. Talk to you later. Phew. I've finally been able to exchange contact info with a few people. Hey. Ah! What What the heck? What's that voice? Full of hatred coming straight from the depths of hell? Huh? Karu? What are you doing here? What the hell do you think you're doing? What do you mean, what do I think I'm doing? You've talked to like 10 women already. What's so fun about talking to women left and right, huh? That's just how this thing works. It's literally a casual matchmaking party. If you wanted to marry anyone, then... Hmm? Y you, you could've... Me? <laughs> hey, Haru? Hey! We left the party and ended up in the regular bar that we drank at. <laughs> Why are you crying so much? I cry a lot when I get drunk. You're a liar. You've never cried before. So... Why did you join the party? You didn't even tell me about it, did you? Uh, that's... 
you had made reservations at the same place, then you could have just told me yesterday. Why did you act like you didn't know what I was talking about? Maybe it was a surprise? You don't need to do that. I was actually pretty surprised though, to be honest. I mean, I guess it makes sense. You want to look for someone to get married to as well, huh? Uh, it's not like that. But you really shouldn't be jealous like that. Huh? I'm sure you probably just got jealous because you couldn't manage to find someone to exchange contact info with, right? You're probably just jealous that I was able to get some action. I wasn't able to talk to everyone perfectly at first either. You just keep going without worrying, you probably could have gotten two or three. I'm leaving. Huh? I'm going to go home. W wait, hang on. What's going on? You're acting so weird today, Karu. I'm not acting weird. You are acting weird. You don't normally get that angry for no reason. You're normally a lot more logical and... Well, I'm sorry to break it to you. This is who I am. Haru? It's your fault for not noticing the way I am this whole time. I've never changed a thing. Alright, don't ever invite me to go out for drinks again. Huh? You're looking to get married to someone, right? You don't need me. Why would you go out with me just for drinks if you're trying to find someone to marry? That's not the same thing. I told you before, Karu, you're my best friend. Even if I get married, I'm going to... That's what I'm talking about. I don't want to because I'm your best friend. Because she's my best friend, huh? What exactly is that supposed to mean? Because she's my best friend. That's exactly why we were able to be so chill and relaxed around each other. Not worrying about romance or anything complicated like that. I thought I was the kind of person to you. <sighs> I've reached out to Karu a few times after that, but she hasn't responded yet. She's leaving red receipts though, so she is looking at them. The fact that she's leaving the red receipts to let me know she's intentionally ignoring me is very Karu-like. Could at least respond to me at least once. Ah! A reply? I thought she texted me back, but I was wrong. It was one of the women that I met at the party today. How about tomorrow night? Huh. Hmm. What is this feeling? I don't feel too into it when a woman is inviting me out to go eat. I went to that party to try to find someone to date. I even paid money for that. Sure. I'm free tomorrow night. I wasn't too into it, but... I have no reason not to go. If everything goes well, I might even be able to move past whatever this murking feeling is. <laughs> You're pretty good with your alcohol, Takasan. Oh, not really. <laughs> hmm. This is slightly awkward. This conversation is not offending anyone. Or that's fancy and for some reason uncomfortable. It's a measurable distance between us. I think some people might enjoy this as being nervous and fluttery of a woman, but honestly, I wasn't the kind of person that enjoyed this feeling. I tried to go to that party because everyone around me was getting married, but I guess I'm just not really good with romance. What do you normally do on your days off anyway? Hmm? Well, normally I go out for drinks and... Ah, then you basically hang out just like you are now. Yeah, I guess you could say that. A little different though. Hey. Hmm? How do you think you're supposed to enjoy being nervous around a woman? Well, that's sudden. What's the occasion? Well, um, I've been trying to find someone to date recently. Huh? You finally figured out your biological purpose in life, huh? I've always wanted a family and kids, but it's not very good at the romance part. Hmm, I don't think you need to enjoy being nervous. Huh? Depends on the person, you know? Some people enjoy it, 
others don't. The important thing is, dude, you want to be with that person or not? Do I want to be with that person or not, huh? Yeah, pretty simple, huh? There is someone that I want to be with. Okay, well, there you go. That's perfect. That person is my best friend. Hmm? Friendship and romance are two different things. I think that I'm super comfortable around her, and I never need to worry about a thing, but... You know. Who told you that those two feelings had to be difficult, huh? Did someone tell you that, or did you just come over it yourself? What? Yo, it's Friday. Yes, I'm aware it's Friday. I said don't invite me out anymore. Oh, come on. Don't be so lame. We're best friends, remember? So what? I said I don't want to do that anymore. Did you forget already? <sighs> I told you that I don't want to go out anymore and you still keep texting me. Now you show up at my door and ask me to go out for drinks. Well, yeah. I like you. You are someone that I cannot find any kind of replacement for. I don't care what you say, I'm not going to back away. I'm not going to disappear. Y you're just gonna say that without thinking about how it makes me feel at all? What? Am I not allowed to say that? No, I'm sure that's because I'm your best friend, right? Then who do I have to be to tell you that? Huh? What would you be satisfied with? Wh what do you mean? One person in the world that I want to be together with the most is you, Karu. I went to that party and I met a bunch of women, and that really made me realize that there is no other woman on the planet that I'm more comfortable around. So, I don't care what label or title you put on it, best friend or otherwise, as long as you're by my side. R really? You're sure? Anything? Yeah. Th then I, I want to be called your girlfriend. Well, why aren't you saying anything? No, um, I just really didn't expect you to like me too. You really said all that earlier without even thinking about how I felt. I actually kind of respect how ballsy you are. Oh, yeah. Huh? You've been keeping your calm recently and not getting all messy, huh? <laughs> well, I don't need to be messy anymore. <laughs>